Rightly or wrongly, Switzerland is often labelled a tax haven. It's almost as synonymous with the country as chocolate or cheese with holes in it. But as a small country with a high cost of living, Switzerland has to be attractive so that companies come and work here and contribute to our economy. And it's not just tax breaks that we're so famous for. Uh, we are also talking about other subsidies, things like public sector loans, state guarantees. And if your company is in trouble, cash infusions. And let's face it, over the last two years, many of our companies have faced tough times during the pandemic. The obvious reaction is to offer more subsidies, things like, for example, short time work, where the government stepped in offering companies cash so that they could continue to uh, pay their employees so there weren't mass layoffs during the downturn. But there is now a suggestion that these could be too much of a good thing. In fact, Avenir Swiss has a new report out this month that's asking if we should put the brakes on these subsidies. And this is a big question because these subsidies also come with big risks, market distortion, for example. And this is a grave issue for a country like Switzerland that relies on unimpeded access to its trading partners, partners like Europe that look less and less favourably on companies that are subsidised.